Mr. Johnson, we'll have your results in just a minute. How are you holding up? Still breathing, I guess, but um, I could I could use some help holding it up if you know what I'm saying. Cute. Well, let's get that checked out. No, 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 no. I'm good. I'm good. Oh. Great. Uh, I'll be right back with those test results. Johnson, you should have come to us sooner. Oh, uh, did y'all have a sale or something? When did you first notice that bump? Oh, Charlie? I don't know, maybe a few months ago? I don't know, I've grown attached to him, I'll Mr. tell you that. Mr. Johnson. I mean, I call my second sec, the ladies <laughs> love Mr. it. Mr. Johnson, there isn't much time. You're going to die. Due to the condition of your head, I'd say you haven't got more than... A day to live. It's, it's a condition called... I don't care what it's called. It can be called Twilight for all I fucking care. I'm still not going to look at it. What do I do now? Mr. Johnson, I suggest you do what you need to do. So just like that? Yep, just like that. That's bullshit. That bitch is a fucking quack. Nah, man. She's like some super doctor. My mom said she graduated like top 10 or some shit. Yeah, we just call these people overachievers. What the hell are you gonna do now? Shit, dude, I don't even know. Does your mom even know? Nah, I figured I shouldn't even worry about that, you know? Just shit. What the fuck are we doing sitting here watching penguins fuck? They're pelicans, man. It's peaceful. I think what Teddy's trying to say is you should be doing something more productive with your life, man. That's exactly what I'm fucking saying. We need to act now. I'm fucking dying, dude. Yeah, but that, that's all the more reason to go out there and live your life. I mean, do something for a change, you know? I mean, if you're gonna burn out, might as well burn bright. Like a diamond? No! no. Megan, Megan, what are you doing? Wait, no, Megan, what are you doing? You've never kissed a girl, right? I have, just like not this week. Or a month, or a year. I've kind of always hoped you were gay. I'm gonna find you a girl. No, wait, why? Do you want to die without kissing a girl in your last 24 hours? So you're not, you're not gay? He brings up a good point, but... All you have to do is go up to a girl and smooch her. It's not that hard. Yeah, I know. It's just... But I don't know. I just... There. Is that so hard? Yeah. 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 God, I know I am. For me? Okay. Do we have anything else that we want to add? Guys, I think we have more than enough. No, fuck that! Is mine on the list? No, I mean, I offered, but he doesn't want to do it. Why not? Dude, I'm not going to pee in his butt. Is that even a thing? I think it's a thing. Guys, I don't have much time, and there's so much on this list. Like, I don't even know what a blumpkin is. Oh, man, it's great. Okay, so a blumpkin is when you take an unsalted stick of butter, and you rub it between your mom's tits, right? And you beat some eggs and cover your dick in it and bread it, and then you titty fuck her. And then you pee in her butt. Okay, okay, guys. Aaron, you gotta stop thinking like that. I mean, what, what what's the worst that could happen? I mean, are, is it gonna kill you to try? Yeah, it might. But is it going to kill you not to try? Oh. Yeah. Well, I guess we have one bucket list to go then. All right. I got this one. Don't ask me how, but I got it. Okay. When you've yeah. got 86,400 seconds to live Spending time with friends We'll be there for you till the end We'll get sunburn on the beach And try our best to help you through We 
might not see you tomorrow so we're doing this for you maybe it's too much but we just want for you to feel when you finally pass it won't be the last we think of you if you're feeling scared we're here to show you that we care and it hurts like hell to know that we will never see you again so what you do is you wrap a towel around a lamp for a few minutes right then you drizzle some menthol and some tabasco sauce on it then you shove your dick in it the fuck dude well, I know it sounds totally weird, but it's alright. My dad showed me. It's awesome. He used to do it all the time when he was over in Nam. Dude, I'm not sticking... Doesn't it burn? No, man. Check it. It's not the heat. It's how hot it feels. No one will be fucking any lamps today. Of course not. Y yeah. Aaron's fucking a lamp. We got it! <laughs> Cthulhu 2. The semen cometh. Oh, dude, you found it? Oh, I had to suck a few bits to get it. But fuck it, man. Oh, dude, great. I mean, gross, but thanks. We gotta do this right. So right. We got beer. We got bitches. Oh, yes, I love bitches. Big Dixie is faces off against Cunt Thulu in a quest for Vajhala. I don't know about you guys, but I'm a little nervous for this one. So, uh, what's so great about this one anyway? You never heard of Cthulhu? Dude, she's a legend. Rumors have it that anybody who watches it loses their fucking minds. It's the most disgusting, most vile porno ever made. Hey guys, wouldn't it be hilarious if like we recreated some scenes from the movie? Wouldn't that be so funny? So what are we gonna do? Are we just gonna watch this? Or I mean... <laughs> <laughs> What? What's so funny? What's so funny? <laughs> it's a gang spank. A what? A gang spank. It's exactly what it sounds like. Exactly. Isn't that kind of... Gay, right? It's not gay. Why not? Dude, bro, it's not gay. Oh no, a bunch of guys whipping out their dicks with each other isn't gay at all. No, it's totally gay. No, no. Exactly. It's not gay. I mean, it's not gay if I mean, if you... Sweat. What? If you really if you enjoy it, sweat, it might be. Of course be. it's gonna sweat. Why wouldn't it sweat if, you know, we're just... We just can't balls. touch each other. How is that even... No, we can't touch no, each other. Hello? Yeah, everything went fine, Mom. She said I could lose a little weight, but... Yeah. Hey, Mom. Thank you. No, for, for everything. I, I just don't tell you enough. I love you, right? No, I just felt like saying it. I love you, okay? Good night. We haven't been all that close lately, but I guess that's my fault. I mean, I feel kind of like a coward depending on you now, but for what it's worth, thank you. 
I'm burning out. But at least I'm burning out brightly. So, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sneaking out on us? You're not that sneaky. You know that, right? Yeah, sorry about that. So what now? Do you just wait? I guess so. Don't you think it's weird that a doctor would give you 24 hours to live and not check up on you at all? She think you're some kind of buzzkill? I left my phone on silent just so I could be with you guys one last night, but... I guess it wouldn't hurt to check. What is it? It's Dr. Lena. She called me 15 times. Good, because I gotta take a shit. <laughs> well, I'm staying. Really? <gasps> Dr. Lena! Dr. Lena. Mr. Johnson? It's just me. You called. Mr. Mr. Johnson, what's your middle name? It's no name. Just, just, oh. Aaron O. Johnson. Kind of like Harry S. Truman. Yeah. Oh, I'm... Oh, there's been a little mistake. A mistake? What, do you... what kind of mistake? Oh, you see, it seems I also have another patient named Aaron Oscar Johnson. Right. Like the baloney. Well, did you call him at least? He's dead. He died in 1996 at home, comfortably. I fucking knew it. I knew there was nothing wrong with my head. Oh, uh, no, there's definitely something wrong with your head. Well, shit. But we have more time to work on it. I Do you know what I put my friends through? Do you know what I've been through? Look, I hope you didn't do anything stupid with your final moments. You know what? I, I went through so much. You know what? Thank you. No, really. Hey, Mom. Let's do lunch. <laughs> 